Welcome to Digital Electronics Lecture Series. I, Professor Hitesh Dolakia, is going to explain you binary subtraction using one's complement in this session. So first I'll explain you the basic steps which is there regarding binary subtractions using one's complement and then we will solve problem based on it. So if I say I have a question in that we have problem like we need to perform a minus b right then here all we will be doing is we will be not subtracting a minus b but here we will be doing a plus minus b operation and let us say this is equals to y right now here this minus b that will be one's complement of b this minus b that will be one's complement of b now here once we perform this task then we need to see what is the value which is there with y as well as what is the carry right so here once you perform this task we need to see whether carry is there or not so in addition if carry is 1 then we need to add carry with y and we can say answer is positive So here when we perform this addition a plus minus b where minus b is 1's complement and if carry is 1 then we need to add 1 with y and we can say our answer is positive right and in addition if carry is 0 then we can say our answer is negative right and that will be 1's complement of y. So as if carry is 0 then answer is negative and answer will be 1's complement of y. So here ultimately what we will be doing is we will be performing a plus complement 1's complement of b operation and we will be observing whether carry is 1 or not. If carry is 1 then answer is positive and we need to have answer is equals to that y plus 1 and if carry is 0 then answer is negative and our answer will be 1's complement of y. So let us solve this by few problems so it will be more clear like how we need to solve this type of questions right. So here we have been given with problem so my first example that is now here we are dealing with to solve this operation right and in that we can say our a is equals to 1011 and our b is equals to 0101. So our first agenda is to identify one's complement. Let us say that is minus b which is one's complement and one's complement of this is 1010 right. Here in one's complement we just need to replace 0 with 1 and 1 with 0. Now we just need to add a and 1's complement of b right. So here perform this operation y is equals to a plus minus b and minus b is 1's complement of b. So if we do this then we need to see what is our output. So 1 plus 0 that is 1, 1 plus 1 that is 0, 0 plus and carry 1 and 1 plus 0 plus 0 that is 1, 1 plus 1 that is 0 and carry 1. So here you can see our carry is equals to 1. It means our answer is positive, right? Our answer is positive and we need to add this one over here and our resultant answer that is positive right and that will be 1 plus 1 0 carry 1 1 plus 0 1 1 
and then 0. So our answer is positive and it is this. Now you can verify that even like you see 1011 so that is 11 and 0101 that is 5. So 11 minus 5 that is 6 and you can see 0 double 1 0 that is 6. So this is how by having one's complement we can solve this where here you can see we have carry and that carry that we need to add it with y that is our final answer and if carry is there we can say answer is positive. Let us have one more problem. So this will gives you a bit clear idea. So here we have second problem. Now in this question let us say a is equals to 0 1 1 0 and b is equals to 1 0 1 0. Now here we need to have this b's once complement. So let us say that is minus b and once complement of that that will be 0 1 0 1 and in that we just need to replace 1 with 0 and 0 with 1. So this is one's complement. Now here we are little bit to perform y that is a plus minus b right. So here we need to add this two data and then we need to see whether carry is there or not. So this a is 0 1 1 0 and this minus b that is 0 1 0 1 and now when we add this so 0 plus 1 that is 1 1 plus 0 that is 1 1 plus 1 that is 0 carry 1 1 plus 0 plus 0 that is 1 so here if you see carry is equals to 0 right here you can see carry is equals to 0 and as carry is equals to 0 we can say our answer is negative. We can say our answer is negative and that is one's complement of this which is y. So one's complement of this that is minus of that is 1 will replace by 0 and 0 will replace by 1. So that will be minus 0 1 0 0 that is how we can say our answer is negative and that is this now here you can cross verify that even so you can see 0 1 1 0 so that is 6 and 1 0 1 0 so that is 10 so 6 minus 10 that is minus 4 you can see that is how our answer is coming right so ultimately here all we need to do is we need to do a plus minus b operation where minus b is one's complement of b right and we need to see whether carry is there or not if carry is there then we need to add answer with one of y and if carry is zero in that case we can say answer is negative and that will be one's complement of this addition y now I'll give you a few problems in homework and I want you to write your answers in comments so that I can understand whether things are happening properly here or not. So here I'm giving you two problems for homework. You write your answers in comment. Definitely I'll get back to you if any mistake is there. So I'm writing questions here. You perform this operation. So this is one problem and second problem is so write your answers in comments right so these are homework questions and definitely I'll reply back to you if any query has been there and please give your valuable suggestions the reason is your suggestions are giving me motivation so the energy of making video that comes from your suggestion so please give it over here it is highly required as i want my channel 
as good as possible right so please give it over here thank you so much for watching this video and please give your valuable suggestions